Hey everybody, thanks for checking out WeAreIowa.com. I'm meteorologist Dave Downey. Another hot day out there today. Not quite as hot as the day yesterday where we hit 97 degrees. Low 90s today. We're going to be flirting with 90 all week until a cold front arrives on Sunday. Finally, we're going to get a cool down on Sunday on the second half of the weekend. We're going to see, also see some on and off rain chances there through Sunday as well. We'll track some of those here in just a bit. Yesterday's high was 97, a hot one out there yesterday. We are still eight inches below where we should be this time of year in terms of precipitation. Now, yesterday was actually, look at this, the second hottest day of the year, to Toasty Tuesday was definitely the story yesterday. It was a scorcher out there yesterday. Today is actually the first sunset that will be before 8 o'clock, and all the sunset until next year will be uh, before 8 o'clock, because yesterday's sunset of 8 o'clock was the final one uh, until 2022. Future cast, I wouldn't be surprised to see a, a stray shower or storm overnight tonight heading into tomorrow morning. I'm going to roll it through first the afternoon hours on Thursday. This is kind of what I'm worried about on Thursday afternoon into the evening. I think northern Iowa is likely to see the bulk of any shower and storm activity. We're actually under a slight risk for tomorrow. Here is your severe weather outlook for tomorrow. A two out of five designation with the Storm Prediction Center. Basically, I-80 and north is where we're seeing that yellow hatched risk of a two out of five, mainly a damaging wind threat tomorrow. Can't rule out an isolated tornado or some large hail, but winds are going to be the main threat for tomorrow. Here are the high temperatures over the next five days. You can really see where the cold front comes through here Saturday night and into Sunday. But until then, some hot weather, 90 tomorrow and then mid 90s for both Friday and Saturday. You can see the average high of 83. We won't get there until the day on Sunday. Today is the last regular zoo brew of the year. A pretty warm one out there this evening, mid to upper 80s this evening. Still probably going to be around that 90 degree mark by the time we kick things off around 5 o'clock tonight. Speaking of tonight, 72 degrees overnight tonight. I think some showers and storms are going to be around. We didn't really see that on the model, but I think we're still at a 30% chance of seeing uh, some isolated showers and storms. Still a muggy night out there tonight with lows in the lower 70s. Rounds of rain tomorrow, we could see a round in the morning, basically between about 4 and 9 or 10 a.m., and then a break, and then another round in the afternoon, basically about after 3 p.m. High of 90 degrees against severe weather is also possible with any activity that does pop up. Saturday is going to be a hot one, then Sunday, a much different story. Morning rain and storms, finally cooler there on Sunday, a tale of two very different halves of the weekend coming up. Here's your Holt Plummy Heating 10-day forecast, three days in the 90s, and after that, that front arrives and cools us down significantly. Can't rule out some lingering shower and storm chances for both Monday and Tuesday, but at least we're back into the low to mid 80s. A gradual warm up is set for next week, which should be dry with highs in the mid to upper 80s.